Hi everyone, I'm David with Guns.com. Today we're talking about holsters for the Springfield XDS. Now, finding a holster for a new gun is sometimes really difficult. It was much more difficult in the days before the internet. Nowadays you get on Google, type in holster XDS, you see who comes up first. As soon as this gun came out, there was a demand for holsters. It's a concealed carry powerhouse. People like the 45 ACP as a concealed carry round. And there were holster makers out there making them pretty fast. The one I've got on right now is an in the waistband from Multi Holsters. You can find them at multiholsters.com. It's an excellent piece of craftsmanship. It's Kydex. It's very simple in its construction, but it fits nicely. It rides really well. And it's very secure. Now the Springfield comes with a holster that looks like this. It's plastic. It's not Kydex. It's injection molded. It's an okay holster. It's got a nice cant to the side of it. that sticks the gun off just a little bit, which makes, at least for right-handed shooters, easy draws for competition. Something like that if you actually would want to compete with something this short. These holsters come with a lot of the Springfield Armory 1911s and 45s these days. But there's a problem with them, and that is that they're not necessarily as fitted as they should be. If you were to use this holster, you would find that the fit's not that great. Now there is a bushing on here and a little screw, actually it's a nut that you can crank down with an Allen wrench, but this one's cranked down pretty far and it's still not holding it quite as tight as I would like. If you put it in, there's a little bit of wobble and any kind of bounce knocks it right out. Well, that's not the case with what you find with some of the more custom form-fitted holsters. The fit is much better. It has a very simple design, it's a one-piece kydex, it's wrapped around, but the belt loop fastener here on the side is held on with two screws and it's got the tension sides here where you can actually screw it down tighter if you want it tighter. But this thing comes reasonably tight. Multi holsters, the way they make their holsters is very simple. They form the kydex around a blue gun which is the traditional look for what you would do for one of these things and then they actually go in and do the finish fit with a real XDS. What this does is it allows for a really precise fit in a holster like this. In this case, what we're talking about is the in the waistband model, but they make all sorts of them. This one here is the outside the waistband model, what they refer to as their multi-holster. Now the fit is just as good. I've got a little bit of a cant on it. But what you have here is an adjustable system that allows you to move the belt loops up and down. So if you like a high ride, you can have that easily enough. If sometime other you want something that'll hide behind a jacket a little bit better, you can put that in there. And there is absolutely no getting these guys out. I mean, I'm holding my hand here just because I don't want to drop the gun. It's unloaded, but still, you see what I mean. And yet, the draw is incredibly smooth, very, very fast. It happens remarkably easily. Holsters like this are not uncommon from individual little cottage industry people like multi holsters. They are uncommon from some of the big or bigger holster makers for months afterwards until they get tooled up to meet the demands of production. But what you have right here is something that works amazingly well. A nice XDS, a nice holder for concealed carry. You've got everything you need right there. So go check them out, multiholsters.com.